Donald Trump's campaign accused British Prime Minister Keir Starmer's Labor Party of blatant foreign interference in the U.S. presidential election in favor of his rival Kamala Harris. The complaint cited a now-deleted LinkedIn post from the Labor Party's head of operations, who wrote that nearly 100 current and former staff would travel to the U.S. to campaign for Harris. Trump's team filed a complaint with the Federal Election Commission calling for an investigation into what it termed apparently illegal contributions from the Labor Party to the Harris campaign. British political activists have long traveled to the U.S. ahead of elections, which is allowed under U.S. rules. What isn't allowed is for these volunteers to make financial contributions. The allegations of interference in this case will hinge on whether the Labor Party covered any activists' costs. Starmer said that didn't happen, and Deputy Prime Minister Angela Rayner gave a similar answer when asked about this in Parliament. Will the Deputy Prime Minister join me in applauding the brave Labour staff members who've travelled across the Atlantic <laughs> to campaign against Donald Trump? <laughs> People in their own time often go and campaign, and that's what we've seen. It happens in all political parties. People go and campaign, and they do what they want to do in their own time with their own money. While the complaint could complicate U.S.-U.K. relations if Trump wins the election, Starmer has denied it would have any impact.